Okay, everyone. Um, bear with me. I'm new at this. Uh, to start out, I'll tell you why we're here in the first place. Um, it's kind of an information session just for everyone to find out what their rights are, charter of rights. Uh, we have a whole agenda. I've asked um, a group to come in from Caledonia that had the experience dealing with this type of thing. Um, you know, I'm really new at it, so I'm not going to even let on like I know what I'm talking about. But the only thing I can say is I did approach the town hall uh, in Deserado to ask them that we be allowed as a municipality to get together and discuss problems that we are facing due to um, blockades and that kind of thing. Um, I have a lot of non-native friends. Um, that are interested in this as well. They have their own issues, I'm sure, and uh, different things they want to address. This isn't to do with the land claim. This isn't to do with what my views are about anything to do with uh, the natives' rights. This is an information session. Just so you know um, where to go for help. Um, so, I was turned down at the hall in Deserado by the town. They were afraid of reprisal from the native people as far as the people from the bridge. And I'm saying we have a right to get together and discuss our concerns and the town should not be able to block us from doing that. If you, if you try to um, diffuse the situation by not letting people speak, you're going to have a problem. So it didn't seem to make any difference. So the next step for me was to see where I could find a hall. Um, there was nowhere in Deserado that they were going to accommodate me. The Legion, yeah. the Legion in, in uh, Deserado did not. Bravo. They would not accommodate me. They, the minute I got to the Legion in Deserado, it was like they knew I was coming. So I phoned the Ox Hall in Picton that we were asked to leave from and asked if we could come in there and have a meeting. My contact person had to drive around from the bridge, as a lot of you, of you did have to, or no people that did. Um, they were quite concerned and they wanted to talk. They just, they wanted to voice their concerns the same as the rest of us did. And said, yeah, you know, come ahead. Well, we'll have a meeting at the Ox. And I said, okay, how much, that kind of thing. We went over prices. The last I heard was 50 bucks. I'll, I'll come over and pay your 50 bucks. I'll, I'll wait till the meeting, no problem. I don't have a problem with any of this. I did not hear till, I believe it was um, oh, a couple of days ago as I'm sure you saw in the paper, that I couldn't have the Elks Hall because the OPP had phoned and said, there's no way there's going to be a meeting there. When I tried to contact the OPP, I was told that he would call me back. I got no phone call from the OPP. You know, this is really professional. So the next thing I did was try to contact the, uh, uh, Mr. Floyd Snyder at the uh, Elks Hall and he wouldn't talk to me. He held the phone out here and I heard people talking in the background and bashing me and, <laughs> and had a few choice words for Mr. Snyder and hung up the phone. So the next thing I thought, well, what do I do now? Well, with a little help from my friends from Caledonia, they have the experience. They're great people. They're not, they're not a bunch of radical people. They said, we will do it anyway. We will have it in front of the Elks Hall anyway. Well, where are we? Not in front of the Elks Hall. The OPP are in front of the Elks Hall. They moved us on, so here we are. So, I guess in a nutshell, that's 
that's what we're doing here. And um, I'm going to give the folks from Caledonia a chance to do their thing. And uh, they have a lot of information for you. And I think you'll find they're just the same as the rest of us uh, as far as being down to earth and that kind of thing. Okay? So um, I guess I've said everything I have to say here. I have a question before you finish. Did you invite him, or did I he did. contact you? Uh, he actually saw my picture in the paper, and he said, I really have some uh, really good information that you might find um, important and, and helpful with, with what you're trying to do as far as voicing your opinion. I have a judgment against the town of Deseronto for an infraction of my rights, charter rights. We're, we're aware of that. Well, yeah. did you did you do any research on this man before you invited him down to talk about our yes. issues? Uh, what did you, you are, learn about? You mean him? our issues? Mean Cindy? As a our issues? Cindy? Cindy? Yes. Cindy? Yes. 